Gets his way up ice. Roslovic, Foodie. Foodie charges in, high slot left circle, and Wedgwood read it. Got over to deny Bemstrom staying with the play. Back for Foodie. And now Bemstrom sends it low. Poke check, Roslovic, and it's scored! The poke check dislodged it, then Foodie got to the loose puck. And late in the first period, it's the Blue Jackets who strike first. His mom was a sprinter, won an Olympic medal. His dad was a defensive back in the CFL, and after some real tenacious work on the puck, a good first poke check by Scott Wedgwood takes care of Roslovic, but the Stars should be under a stick and in better position than that on Fudu, who came in on the backhand and ripped it home. Is Jamie Benn taking this drop with Wyatt Johnston and Ty, or excuse me, Dennis Gurionov off to his flanks. Getting off the ice rather than, than trying to get out of the zone first. So close. They're not as close as some others. Big Hawk and Pot lumbering up there to add another guy to the attack there. One thing the Blue Jackets have handled against the Stars so far are long stretch passes. They say onside, Robertson scores! And out of the zone, guys were heading back off the ice, and this time Robertson, who loves five hole, dials it in. The question's going to be, was he onside? Long lead, crisp. Liberation pass by Niels Lundqvist. And then Robertson, who's so deadly when he's solo with a netminder. We saw that again last night in the shootout. There's any problem with that. Right in front of the Stars bench. Who's so, over on the yeah, other side someone, changing? Someone's coming back yeah. from the offensive zone. And, and it was recognized. It was a race to the blue line. After video review, it was determined that the play was offside. Therefore, we have no goal. Please reset the clock to 14.38. All right, beg your pardon. Three seconds to the clock. And the Stars will remain down 1-0. Roslovic across and wedge with a save on Boquist. How big is that stuff? Softly around the boards. And a shot by Peak. Past the reach, Blankenberg. Johnson turned it over to Landria. He's got help right circle. Delandria scores! <laughs> Terrific individual effort from Ty Delandria. And Dallas is tied it. After the kid Johnson burps it up, a casual play picked off by Delandria. And, and his shot just messes up the netminder. Doesn't get a ton on it. It goes right on the egg, almost identical to how Robertson just beat him. Instead of dropping down in a, in a full butterfly, he sort of collapsed on himself. Jackets got their goal, Liam Foody, first of the season, first of his career, late in the opening frame. It was Roslovic and Bemstrom on the helpers. Pressure here from the Stars. Centering feed, looking for Ben. And then a shot scored! As Corpusala was going one way, the puck came back. Great Hotzel on the forecheck. Our All-State Mayhem moment. Puck goes down the ice. Boquist pinched up in neutral ice, so there was no icing on it. The legs of Guriana got in and after Bayreuther. And it was that forecheck that resulted in the goal. Jamie Benn couldn't control it. Johnston so alert, anticipates so well, roars in there, grabs it, and deposits it past a scrambling Jonas Corposalo. After video review, it was determined that there was goaltender interference, and we have no goal. Talented, offensive, slanted young rear guards. This time, Lundquist with the chip. Bernie had trouble with it. A shot, glove save. Corpus Salo denying Freddie Olofsson in his return to the NHL. Loves it down in the trapezoid. Spun by Johnston. 
Olivier stays with it, ducking underneath the check from Suter. Corrali bumps it over to Boquist. Fire, score! Holy hammer. Adam Boquist getting it for the Jackets. They kill off the penalty and then reclaim the lead here in the third period. Well, they come out of that penalty kill and in behind the Stars net, there's a battle for the puck multiple times. Olivier is able to protect it against both Johnston and then Suter. They get their rotation and Kabang, it looked like it changed direction. This hit a stick. Step to it. Yep. Read off the reach blade. And you can tell in the body language and the quick. Hockenpah will hustle after a loose puck. Unable to clear. Kept alive. Hand off line. A nice move. Marchenko and what a stop. How in the world did Wedgwood get over? Hold on the PK. The biggest reason why Wedgwood, the highlight reel, reach and save on Marchenko. Got away from Fox along the perimeter. Shot by Karlstrom. Right wing side. Hawk and Palm. Loose in front and a save made. Corpusallo as it fell for Fox. Kept by Miller and then Robinson swiped away by Miller and he probably saved the breakaway if he doesn't do that. A couple very good aggressive plays by Colin Miller. Jacket space through center. Robinson this time can fly from the right circle. Score! Wedgwood tried to hang on to it and the puck got passed. Buried and the Jackets double their lead. Spit aside. They get a rush chance. The initial shot just leaps through on Wedgwood. He's out on his angle. Robinson's got that left shot down the right side thing going on and just couldn't keep it in front of him. Off on the periphery, it's a dunk for Olivier. They've gotten good minutes out of their fourth line in this one tonight. Icing here against the Blue Jackets. Across to Robertson. Return for Suter. Snaps a shot. Hit traffic again. And wide of the cage. And then turned over. It's Olivier for Robinson. From center ice, he shoots it wide, trying to catch up himself. They might count that. He gets taken down by Haskinen. If you award a penalty shot with an empty net, it's an automatic goal. They won't do that. But here's a conference. They didn't initially do that. And now maybe a discussion. Jamie Ben scored a goal like that once. Kept in the zone. Foodie, another shot fought off by Wedgwood. And that'll do it. The Jackets, on the strength of a big third period, pick up a 4-1 win.